Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Weasel and today I'm going to play Scraps, a game that is currently on Kickstarter, so if you enjoy the game, you can uh, support it and, well, basically make it happen. Um, it is currently, uh, as I said, on Kickstarter and in a very early build, but you can already play it and um, play around with the build mechanics. So, as I said, you can build your own car or at least like take several parts of things. Uh, several parts like a chassis and add things to it um, What you definitely will need um, is a cockpit. So as you can see this is our um, Build screen um, the little crosses show you where you can attach things and um, then you can Also uh, change the suspension and you can add armor um, And all those things to it. Uh, you do need power you need um, um, Movement like a large engine and you need all kinds of things all kinds of things on your car and then you can fight against other people uh, your friends the AI whatever right now You can only drive it around and shoot like blocks nothing too fancy But let me show you how we build a car in Germany Oh, we Germans are very proud of our car building skills. So let's see what I can come up with um, Let's definitely add some um, We will definitely need some capacitors so um, to save up all the energy that we're uh, generating for all the weapons we're gonna add. Um, that only makes sense. Uh, and let's add a large generator and a large generator. You'll see what I'm doing. You're wondering why is, doesn't he add a cockpit already guns? You'll see. You'll see. Uh, let's add another large capacitor. So that should provide enough stuff, I guess. Now we need engines. Engines. Very important. We do need our engines. Um, this might not make any sense in a multiplayer environment. Um, this does not make any sense at all, probably. Um, in any circumstance. Um, let's add some engines and let's add some large ones. Now let's... You're gonna get a little bit further. There we go. This looks fine. So we have about uh, nearly a thousand kilowatts, whatever it's called. Um, and we can have a lot of capacity for power. We need power to shoot our weapons. Anyway, now let's add a cockpit. There we go. Um, well, it looks lovely, doesn't it? It already looks lovely. So let's, you know what? We're actually gonna test that right now. Um, the basic vehicle controls. Yes, you can drive around with WASD. Oh yeah, this one is fast. That's a fast little fella. And you can drive around in this um, lovely wasteland. Let's call it wasteland. And, whoa, this one is fast. Ooh, nice flips. And we're done. Um, I'm showing you how to fire guns and whatnot. So this is already working pretty well. As you can see, it's leaning a little bit back. Show center of physics. It's on the back side. So we might want to add some things in the front. Um, we could add some large capacitors at the front again. But nah, gonna add weapons. Uh, medium cannons. Well, no, I want small machine guns at the very front of it. Medium cannons over it. And uh, let's see if we can add a nice large cannon to it. Yeah, we could. We could add one there. Let's add more medium cannons. Can I put them? Nah, nah, doesn't want to. Hold on, okay. If you want to get rid of something, you just click it. That works pretty well, actually. And then you just... Let it go again. There we go. Okay. Um, that looks pretty deadly to me. Um, let's add... Yeah, let's add those two machine guns anyway. So... Oh, wait. Not this one. A medium machine gun. There we go. So if you hold on to a... Um, if you hover over something, you see the radius it can shoot. Um, right now, this is very limited. The large cannon, though, can... Um, wait. Actually, we need extender blocks. Let me show you. Let me show you what I mean by that. Uh, we need a little bit of room to add more stuff to it. So you can basically make this thing as big as you want. Um, unless physics tell you, no, that doesn't work anymore. But apart from that, you can be pretty much creative. This is just a creative build mode. Okay, now, now you see, if I hover over them, you can see that, it can, that they can um, move around in a 180 degree uh, circle. Um, a little bit more. And they could go 380, but that's right now not possible. So we're going to add a few extenders to that. Let's see. 
Can I put a gun? Oh yeah, now I can. Now they can turn around 180, uh, 360 degrees. So let's do that and add arch cannon. If you want to turn around, let's say like the small machine guns, like these ones that I want to shoot to the side with, you just um, hover over it um, or press right and it will turn them. That doesn't work for this one actually. I need to use the large cannon. Um, for example, now I press right click and it turns them. So I could add cannons in the back. I definitely need cannons in the back, don't we? Uh, we, we should test this out now. This seems pretty deadly. So um, let's get some really smooth suspension going. And well, let's, uh, let's put it close to the ground. I think that's fine. Let's test that one. Well, that seems pretty smooth. Let's see how the shooting works with... This is my little machine gun at the front. Really unimpressive, I gotta say. All the machine guns at the front, still not very impressive. They can't really move around. And now let's try that with all my guns. Yep, that's more like it. That's that's what I wanted to see. That's now a very deadly car. That can potentially destroy everything. It looks definitely very intimidating. And it can be very fast. Again, this is a very, uh, very early build, so... The terrain is not the most beautiful, as you can imagine. I mean, there are more important things to this game than the terrain. But, yeah, you will be able to fight with... Oh, oh, hey, you stay there. You will be able to fight with your friends in here or online against other people. Um, just make sure to check out the Kickstarter page. There's everything explained um, how to make this happen. And I'm now trying, I'm now adding a few more engines. Um, where's the center of mass? Oh, it's actually in the middle, neat. Now this thing has over a thousand kilowatts. Let's see how that works. Uh, it's definitely faster. Whoa, okay, I just pressed shift and that happened. I think this is to flip you around if you're stuck. Oh, this is just working fine. Um, so right now you can really go crazy with all of this. Uh, let me decrease the volume a little bit. Um, you can basically just go mental. There seems to be no physical limitation whatsoever. Oops, no, there you go. And... Um, I don't even know if that 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 is actually still like something that I don't think this is something that would ever work in real life never ever and I feel like these four tires are um well are really boned okay so now as you can see uh, I think we have to like improvise a little bit and get rid of that stuff and add more weight at the front definitely more engines more engines this is probably the most ridiculous car I've ever built or seen. And the large cannon cannot fire. That's really tragic, I gotta say. That's really tragic. So let's see how 2,000 kilowatts or I don't know how many thousand horsepower do. This is a lovely car. I would drive this every day. I would drive this to get groceries. And then I would shoot my way through walls. I would not need to go on streets with this car. I'm pretty sure this thing could fly if I do it correctly. Well, that's lovely. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like, it really helps out a lot. Um, you can play this game yourself, as I mentioned. The link to the game is in the description below and to the Kickstarter campaign, so make sure to check it out. Um, if that is something that speaks to you, go ahead and support it. Um, you can back it for as little as $5. Anyway, I'm Weasel, I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye-bye!